finally after a lot of years Google Play Store is rolling out massive design change. You know Google have already made lots of changes and improvements onto the mobile version of the Play Store and not just one but many times but the desktop version hasn't been changed from many years. Today is the day Google is rolling out this massive Google Play Store update. Talking about the changes, the new layout makes use of all the negative space giving each app listing plenty of room to stand out. Here you can see the previous version of the Play Store had this uh, left hand sidebar that highlights the tab for games, apps, books and other stuff. In the new version of the Play Store, here you can see onto the top right corner, there you got tabs for apps, games, movies, books and all the things. Additionally, there is a new kids tab, probably have also noticed it's got round corners everywhere as opposed to old square up edges. Also the changes are not limited to just the interface change, there are newly added menus as well. If you head over to the game section, here you can see optimize games for your phone, tablet, TV and Chromebook. And even more, if you got watch and car, these categories are also available in your web version of the Play Store. In the new version, if you try to install any of the application, here you can see list of all of your devices onto which you can install this app. Previously, if your children are making lot of purchases without your authentication, well now you can. This additional step of authentication can be applied onto the Play Store, the web version and the mobile version as well. Moreover, the web version now has a Google Sans font and honestly Google Play web interface is much clean and user friendly this time and it looks much similar to the mobile version of the Google Play Store. Even more, the categories for each of your devices should narrow down the application that you are looking for and you will able to find your apps much more easily. If you head over to your settings, this new Google Play web settings menu, you can set your email options and also able to adjust the section if you want to receive the notifications about the new updates in the Google Play. And also there is an authorization options which let you decide whether you want to buy applications from Google Play web or Google Play Store from your mobile version, which I think is a good security option. This is the new Google Play web device management menu. Here you can check all the devices that you have signed in with. Also you got date of your device, when it was last used and there is a switch to hide unused device from the application installation menu. With all those changes, how is your Google Play user experience? Well do let me know in the comments down below. Guys we are pretty close to 100k subscribers so make sure to hit that subscribe button, share this video with your friends, hit that like and this is Kedar from How to Guys signing out.